Well, after the professional hypocrite and victim, Meghan Markle and that co-winer Soyboy, under her directive and command, were booted from their UK home by King Charles in a long overdue act, uh, it has since found support from somebody in a particularly high place and somebody who knows Harry very well. That would be none other than Harry's brother, William, okay? Uh, who, by the way, has been mercilessly trashed uh, in this uh, Wine and Whinge manifesto Harry published on January 10th. So, any of them have a right to be angry, by the way, too, uh, as any sibling would when they're just trashed mercilessly by somebody they, you know, somebody they, that's supposed to really care about them. But it says here in the article on The Mirror, Prince William, behind Harry and Meghan's Frogmore eviction, claims Lady Victoria Harvey. Lady Victoria Harvey has sens sensationally claimed that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle being evicted from Frogmore Cottage due to William being unhappy. You know? And like I said, he has every right to be unhappy, considering how, how just how mercilessly he's been trashed. And I'm not saying I'm a, I'm a huge royalist, but you know, people have a right to get angry at this kind of stuff when they're, when they're trashed by somebody who's supposed to be family. So anyway, continuing on in the article, it says, speaking on Nana Akua's GB news program, Lady Victoria addressed speculation that her friend Prince Andrew was moving out of his home, uh, Royal Lodge, and into Frogmore Cottage after Harry and Meghan were evicted by the king. She said the first thing to say about Royal Lodge is that it's only about 10 bedrooms and there's no swimming pool. Every newspaper has said it's got 30 rooms. That's completely incorrect. I think it's also quite obvious that this is Prince William, want, that this is Prince William wanting the house. Yeah. And maybe he should get it, you know, because again, getting trashed by a sibling is not all that fun. And you know, just because you're just because you're royalty doesn't mean you don't have the right to, you know, get angry at stuff. Uh, it says in the article, it's been claimed that Andrew is moving to the cottage after the royal lodge has been left, remaining uh, requiring extensive repairs, including a leaking roof, despite the Duke of York having his allowance cut. Lady Victoria went on to say, there, uh, this has nothing to do with budgets. This is William wanting the big house. He's not happy in the small one. For Prince, for Prince Andrew, he's been in the royal lodge for 20 years. It was his grandmother's house. It's very uh, sentimental, and he's got the dogs, so why should he move? Well, really, he ought to be, he ought to really, the only room he ought to be staying in is the prison cell, you know, because, you know, he's basically a nun, so I'll put it that way. He's a, a perverter, a, you know, a pervert of a different level. So, that's the only room he ought to be staying in is the uh, room that is provided to the prisoners in their cell. But it says in the article, continuing on, the Queen's dying wish was for him to stay at the house, but King Charles just wants to boot him out. A spokesperson for the Duke and Duchess of, Su of Sussex confer uh, confirmed that they had been asked to vacate Frogmore Cottage three years after announcing they were stepping down as senior working royals. Yeah, here's something interesting as well. They're, they're still claiming that title. They're still using that title to their advantage to make lots and lots of money to whine and whinge on their hit piece series on Netflix. Uh, but they want the, they want the cake, you know. They want to eat the cake, but you know, essentially they they don't want to actually do the duties of royals, but they still want to have that title, you know. They want to eat the, you know. I forget how the whole saying goes, but either way, you know, they're not really doing the job they're supposed to have that comes with that title. But anyway, what's really be expected of them? And again, his brothers have a right to be angry at, at being mercilessly trashed by a sibling in a in a book revealing all kinds of private details, you know. Which is what he was attacking the media for doing, for invading his privacy. Now he's basically done the exact same thing. I mean, this is what's known as rank hypocrisy. But hey, what's to be expected? So anyway, I wanted to just point that out. It's fun just laughing at this whole match. Just laughing at how these two, uh, Harry and also the one who is basically clearly controlling him. That profes the, yeah, professional victim, Meghan Markle. How they just basically just made fools out of themselves every time they get in front of a camera. But anyway, just wanted to laugh at the whole thing. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye. Thank you.